Okay, guys. Um, I'm actually about to go into my parenting class today, but um, I wanted to talk about something. And excuse the roughy hair. I got that. Excuse me. Is this Friday? But um, I was talking to a friend's mom today and two days ago, and something occurred to me that I kind of want to share with you guys. It was, it was the the idea and the thought of racing thoughts, the uh, struggle of never having your brain kind of shut down. Um, she brought up the topic and she was saying something that just struck me as true. Um, people who tend to just like work to the bone and be able to just constantly give their 100% effort in their actual day-to-day -day activities don't tend to have racing thoughts because by the time they go to bed, they're tired. They're ready to go hit their head on the pillow and boom, done. But people who, let's say, have less to do, they tend to have racing thoughts. It's hard for them to go to sleep. Some kind of unresolved situation makes it hard for them to do that. Um, so I guess as my suggestion today, um, something that I learned I want to share is just if you feel that you have racing thoughts, uh, more often than not, try to exhaust yourself in things during the day. Don't allow yourself to rest. Don't allow yourself to, like, you know, take it easy. Push yourself to do a little bit more than what you did the day previously. That way, whenever it's time for bed, you're just like, oh, wow, I'm actually ready for bed. I'm ready to put my head on this pillow, go to sleep, wake up, you know? And if it's like, well, I don't want to go to sleep, like, I, I don't like the things I do, then I guess this is the opportunity for you to figure out what you like to do and do those things. I want you guys to be able to see the positive side of life, to be able to do what you want to do and to achieve your goals and dreams. And you're not going to do that by not doing it. You're not going to do that by just waiting for something else to happen to get you started on it. I'm hoping this video kind of gives you the motivation and the kick in the pants and the fire underneath your ass to be able to do the things that you want to do because that's the important thing in life. All right, well, I got to get going. I got class soon because I got my own fire underneath my own ass that I want to take care of. So I hope this helps somebody <laughs> because it's helping me. See you guys later. And, and thanks for listening.